The Korean government has released the employment rate for June, an important barometer of what the local economy or whether the local economy is on a solid recovery path. Unfortunately, the figures don't make pretty reading. Our Kim Jeon reports. Job figures for the month of June are gloomy, to say the least. The number of people in Korea's workforce was up 310,000 in June, compared to the same month last year, the lowest on-year climb in five months. Statistics Korea says the number of people employed rose in general in June, except for those in their early 20s, with the employment rate at 61.4 percent, while the unemployment rate for June stood at 3.8 percent. The youth unemployment rate of 10.5 percent for June was the highest recorded for the month since 1999. The real unemployment rate felt by 15 to 29-year-olds has risen to a record high in June at over 23 percent, up nearly two percentage points from the same period last year. The statistics agency attributed this to the shrinking number of jobs young people prefer, particularly in sectors related to science and technology. By sector, the number of people employed in food and lodging decreased for the first time since December 2011, inching down by 1.7 percent on year in June, to below the levels recorded in 2015 when the country suffered from the MERS outbreak. Luckily, employment in the manufacturing sector has risen for the first time in a year by 0.4 percent in June, largely due to a rise in exports and because of a base effect as figures were unusually low due to a recession last year. Meanwhile, the number of people not included in the workforce due to childcare or education decreased by 24,000 in June from the previous year, while the number of people giving up employment rose by 29,000 on year to 449,000. The number of self-employed has also risen by more than 41,000, continuing its 11-month increase. Kim Jian, Arirang News.